So I looked at the new chat GPT 4 ohm or 4 o to see what's going on there. So is it the doom of coders? Are we done? Is it over? No, no, no. It's an interesting update. So it's a little bit better with the coding, for sure. And its main updates, I think, it's that it's more, it's quicker. So it responds much more quickly. And it adds more inflection, if you will, in the responses. It sounds like more human. So instead of it talking like this, uh, ChatGPT talks like this now. So it's a little bit more lively, which is good. It's great for tutoring. You can also use your phone, scan things, and it will be able to read things you read on paper and give you responses. So it's really cool. Don't get me wrong, but no, it's not, it's not going to replace coding. It might one day. I don't know. It will, well, it definitely will one day. But you got to understand, for those who are, do, are so scared about coding, there's those who somebody commented on one of my posts said, oh, that's it. It's over for coding with AI. These are people who don't know anything about coding. Hey guys, this video is sponsored by PenPod at PenPod.app. This is an online visual editor for your web layout. Very powerful, supports full grid in your brand new 2.0 version. It's free, by the way. It has all kinds of capabilities in there. Group asset management, easy collaboration amongst team members, annotations, and so much more. Check it out, PenPod.app. Link is below. It's pretty powerful and it's free. You have to understand, ironically, the actual time that you spent writing code when coding is just a small part of the process. The hard part about coding is putting all the pieces together. I'll go into more detail in another video, but again, trust me, if I thought that coding was doomed, I would let you know. My honest opinion, based on my three decades of experience, the AI revolution is much more impactful in that it's broad-based meaning it affects all kinds of different areas like translations and uh, tutoring and so many other things. But in terms of coding itself, I have seen other technologies previous to AI that were far more impactful in terms of development than AI is at this point. I'll give you an example. Uh, when we went to page-based web app development, that was far more uh, impactful, far more productive than what AI is doing for coding. Like, it's not even close. It's not even close. I talked about that. I, just, I did a project once when I first did page... I went from traditional uh, pro CGI development for web apps to page-based development, and I took a project that another company took 12 months. They couldn't get it to work. It was 12, 14 months. They couldn't get it to work. I rewrote from scratch with a new technology. I was able to get it done in 30 days. I was literally more than 10 times more productive and it did not kill developers. It just changed the way we, we did things. Uh, another technology that came out years ago, in my opinion, are far more impactful in terms of web development than AI. Content management systems, WordPress, Drupal, Joomla, and there's several others out there. They're far more impactful in terms of its, uh, in terms of productivity, in terms of the changes it makes, it made to uh, development, in this case, web development. So is AI important? Of course, you gotta learn AI. I'm adding AI modules to my mentoring program. We talk about it all the time. Something to, it's just a tool, it's just a tool. So no, don't worry about four ohm, I think it's just good. Um, learn about, you gotta, you gotta be on top of the AI landscape as a developer now, because it's a tool to use, right? It would, it would be silly to ignore it. So there you go. The doomers who say it's over for coders, they, they haven't coded. I think a lot of people who are dooming the code are people who, having a, who are having a hard time learning how to code. So they're working, for, they're, they are looking for an excuse. They are looking for an escape. Ah, that's shit anyway. I don't need to do this stuff. People do that all the time. They poo poo on stuff that is hard for them, which is good because when something is hard, it's valuable. And when it's valuable, you get paid a lot more. So we want more doomers who are scared of uh, AI, ooh, AI, because they don't want to deal with the hurdles of learning to code. That's what it is. That's what I think it is. Because there's no experienced developer out there will tell you that they, once they use AI, they realize it's good. It's good to use, but it helps. But it ain't replacing anything. So there you go. Cheers.